Hi guys and welcome back to another video. What it's like to be married to a Pakistani man. One of you guys left it in the questions on my Instagram. I have almost nine years of experience, almost 13 years experience what it's like to just be with a Pakistani man. So first things first, he can't handle the weather because his hay fever is just insane. So from the morning all the way till about mid afternoon, his eyes are like this and he's sneezing and bogeys are flying out of his face. Are you okay? No, not right now. What is it? What's oh, wrong? Oh man. Is it your, your hay fever? <laughs> Show me them eyes, boy. The house is filled with things like this. Someone kill me now. I just, what? <laughs> Tend to disappear for about half an hour to an hour. You come to find out that they're just on the toilet. Random boxes left out. This is from yesterday. He opened it, he tried it on, and then he decided to put it right here in the middle of the room. And I'm guessing this is the place it's gonna live now for the next few weeks. Look at this video. Things my husband says to me daily. Can you chill, bro? I got this He supports all of the content creation I like to make. That is because I'm Pakistani. Yes. Yeah. Are you recording me? Why? <laughs> There's always some kind of pain. He's always in pain. What's wrong with your belly? <laughs> if it's not the hay fever, it's his belly. <laughs> Dear Lord. He leaves his food out and just expects me to put it in the microwave. Well, put it in the microwave then. <sighs> also that. Usually when I'm at home, I'm always in my pajamas, so he'll always answer the door for me. Whoa. My husband is one of the best chefs. Oh, it's a chef! He's a chef! <laughs> he likes to cook and he's always feeding us. We have to have two cupboards full of spices. Most of them are haldi powder. <laughs> after he cooks, unfortunately, he forgets to clean up after himself. But that's okay, because he don't cooks. don't forget. Oh, rude. <laughs> what do you mean? I don't forget. <laughs> if you ever need a really good hiding space, my husband has great places in the house to hide important things, like your slippers. So whenever I ask him, hey Sid, have you seen my slippers? He'll not know where they are, but all I need to do is go into his little man cave, and sure enough, here they are. Collect! nicely for me to never find along with a bag of tools his tools is the only thing he'll keep neat in a nice bag got a lot of tools I don't think they've been used in about two years though we need milk we need milk yeah we need milk okay do I look like a milkman you recorded <laughs> <laughs> go to the shop love <laughs> he's obsessed with crypto it's not crypto my Pakistani husband works a lot. He overworks. It's actually half six in the evening and he's still working. Doesn't like to sit up straight, so he's creating himself a hunchback <laughs> at the ripe old age of 35. That's better. <laughs> I just came back from the gym, so I'm a sweaty mess. You do. Really? Well, I've got the best business idea, literally. This is the one. Another Honestly. business idea. Can we finish the five other businesses we started, please? <laughs> In all seriousness, it's my Pakistani husband's birthday today. How old are you, you gorgeous hunk of a hairy man? 62. 36. Wow, you're really putting my age oh, out there. Oh, you don't want like it on there? Okay, then. Oh, yeah, what? Well, you should be proud. He's taken three years off. And Babes, you day. should be proud of everything you've achieved up until you're this age and be proud of yourself and happy birthday because you are i'm just happy to be alive we're happy that you're alive you're appreciated we love you your kids are lucky to have you mm -hmm. you know and we just hit a gym session this morning what a way to start your birthday you're being so nice that's you're a gonna, vibe are you gonna prank me or something no it's just your birthday so it's one day of the year that I'm lovely wife. <laughs> Guess what we're doing for Sid's birthday? Taking uh, it back to where it all began. We're taking it back to where <laughs> it all began, which is Nando's. <laughs> that was our first date. We went for a Nando's, a cheeky Nando's. And we're going to go do that now to celebrate your birthday. This is your 13th birthday with me. 13. 13 birthday. 13 years. Wow. Of birthday celebrations. That is crazy. Alhamdulillah, mashallah. I think that's bad. It's lovely. Listen, some disgusting PDA coming at you. I love you. <laughs> We're in Nando's, and one thing I forgot to tell you is that 
Sid almost every single time sends back his chicken yeah, because, because he always says it's too dry. But it is. Some things never change and I just sit here like this like... I just knew it beforehand. They just continue to do it.